Hi everyone, welcome to set 6 of my Tyler Tasmanian Tiger 2 Let's Play. We've just come to Teeter Tottering Inferno, where we'll be going to Sulphur Rocks, and also doing two other missions, which aren't shown on here. Uh, hopefully that should cover up the in cover the entire of set 6, that's what I'm hoping. And I'll put Deep Sea Scare, Bushfire, and the boss uh, of this chapter in um, set 7, so that's what I'm hoping anyway. <sighs> the, the whole reason this has been segregated into an entire set is because it is so huge. As you'll soon find out. I haven't actually properly shown you what this does with an enemy, have I? You drill it into the ground, and uh, you get money for it. I think it's the same amount of money that you'd get um, if you were killing it normally. So I think it gives you twice the amount then by that stand. Well, that was useful. Uh, clearly, it's not that one. There must be a hidden one somewhere. There you are. Ta-da! Magic. Right then, let's uh, have a go at these, shall we? Now what these do is when you stand on one, uh, a bunch of them disappear, leaving only a couple left. Um, so you have to make your way over to there. Oh, have I done this in one? Oh, I say, I've done it in one go! Oh, that's magical. I don't remember that sequence, just in case they come up again. I think they do, later on in the level. Alright, so it's like an S shape. Magic. Only three more left and we can get into the map. Not quite sure which one, though. Really not sure which. I think I'll get the Cogs one, because Steve is really quite easy to find, actually. I don't know why I had such trouble with him when I was, uh, when I was younger. But, um, oh yeah, I've got loads of opals now. Which is fantastic. Every time you do a route around the entire of the Boromudgy area, you get about 10,000 opals. If you do it the way I do, anyway. Uh, right. So, this place isn't, oh my goodness, right. This place isn't really that fun. Just because of how many enemies there are. Okay. Marvelous. Now for these. Excellent. I really wish I hadn't uh, upgraded the Smasherang. Having the Smasherang would be really kind of useful. And it's not necessary if you've got the Deadly Rang. Hello. Sneaky thing. Right, we haven't collected anything yet. So, uh, let's see what we can find up here. Bit of a pointless um, bunyip section, to be honest, considering they were only frills. If there were giant frills, I could understand. Not regular ones. Or oh, uber frills. Ooh, I see a cog. Get that later. Let's have a look around here. Oops. Oops. Right, let's see what we've got going on around here. Right, let's try not to fall down there just yet. Cool. Right, what's up here? Aha, I see you. Why do I hear a flamethrower? Ah, a cog. Cogulicious. Alright, let's mark it off. Now, where are the cogs? It's here. Right, there's quite a lot of those. Eight more to find. Yeah. Hello. 
Uh, that was the wrong weapon. I assumed I had that out. Oh, and a picture frame. Oh, and another picture frame. Uh, one of the dangers of using an explosive ring. Oh, nothing up there. Right, let's get up here, shall we? And over here, I think. Oh, this, by the way. You can climb on. It's not exactly very obvious, but... Oops. Yeah, you can climb on that. Uh, I do apologize if I yawn a bit in this. I'm, I really did get too much sleep and I've broken into my next sleep cycle. Ta-da! Right, how do I get that? Um, aha, hello. Right, so there's a button and there's this. What does this do? Okay, so we've got some old picture frames here. Oh, don't miss one. And we can reach the cog. Delicious. Let's mark it off. Okay, now where? I don't think we can go back, can we? No. So we've got to go back round. Can I can I just jump up here? Yeah, there we go. Right. Well, what does the button do then? Shall I see? There we go. I see. Okay. Right. How do I get there then? Aha! Off we go. Anything over here? Oh, there's a bilby. Alright, well, let's get that then, shall we? Before I forget about it. B. There we go. B for Billy B. Billy B. Licious. Do, do. Oh, dear. There we go. Right. Oh, and another Bilby. Coolio. These guys really aren't hard when you've got the deadly rang, seriously. Alright, so that's giving me access to that, but how do I get that 3000 opal thing there? Can you see that? On top of the, uh... The crate? Hmm. Let's have a look. Perhaps I can access it. Mm. No, it doesn't let me go that far. Huh. There must be something I'm missing here. There must be a way of getting up there. Hmm. Not sure. Ah, boxes. Right, uh, but that's not really what I want. What I need is something. Invisible platforms? Uh, let's get the X-ring out. No, there's nothing. Oh, wow, there's quite a lot of boxes here. Uh, but that's really not what I need. Oh, hello. Oh. I should have this thing out more often. Um, well, how do I get get onto it though? All right, it doesn't it doesn't like that? Oh, stop beeping! There we go. Ah, gotcha. Oh, hello. Cool. Oh, Oh, five hundred. Right, so that's a koala bear. Not that many of those in here, actually. Right, uh, what else is there? Can I reach anything from here? Mm, doesn't look like it, does it? Hmm. Forgot to knock off the other, the 
the building. There we go. Uh, oh, I wonder if I can get to it from there. Perhaps I don't. No, it's on. It's completely the wrong side. I wonder if it's one of those project projectile flower thingies. Could be, but where would I find it? Because there isn't one around here. That is seriously annoying. Anything over here? No? No? Nothing? No, I can't see anything. Hmm. At a bit of a loss here. I'm stuck. I don't know. Not quite sure. Oh, hello. Oh dear. You guys are no match for my deadly rangs. Like, seriously. Okay, so that's the way we're supposed to go. Uh, but what's over here? Ah, another cog. Fantastic. Cool. Raking them in. But still none. Oh, still none the wiser as to how to get that 3,000 opal bag. That is really something I want right now. Hmm. Let's have, an, let's have another look as to uh, see if I can see anything around the area. I mean, there must be something. That just get that button just gives you access to. Oh, hang on a minute. There we go. I just did that, so I, I completely forgot that I could do that. There we are. There's a couple more picture frames. Um, righty ho. Cool. Worth the effort. Off we go. At least my cough is pretty much gone. Ooh, ivy. Or something. Not really sure about plant life. Not much of a botanist myself. Is that it? Two boxes? Okay. Right, we can go up here. Where does this lead us? Aha! Yay. Cool. Fine. Okay, so that's another chromium orb. What is that? Like two more left? Yep. Uh, in here, chromium orbs, we've gotten two so far. And there are seven in the whole place. So yeah, by the end of this by the end of this map, we'll be able to afford another map. Um You know what I mean. Okay, so there's quite a fair way quite a lot to do here, so. Let's have a look. Uh, oh, I see a bilby over there. I don't, how do I get there then? I wonder. Can I just jump that? Yeah, I can just jump that. Okay. There we are. Right, let's have a look over here. Oh, there's an arrow, so maybe not. It's, it, it seems like it's leading me in all sorts of directions. Okay, is there anything over here? Another bilby! <laughs> Imagine that! There's only one more left to find now. Uh, I, th I thought this place would be bigger. So far we've seemed to have collected half of the uh, the things to collect in this place, and it's only been 17 min or 18 minutes. Right. Uh, kind of going through this level a little bit quick. Right, well we've been, we've been there. We've been up there. Let's try this way. Alright. Explosions. My favourite. Ah, oh, I miss them. Anything over here? It's quite dark. 
No, I don't like it. Okay, so what's up here? Alright, I've been up there. I've not... Um, well, I've not finished it up there, did I? I never actually went across the walkway. So let's have a look, see if there is anything. A strange sound effect. I'm not sure what that was. Ah yes, and there's this place. Alright. Let's try that again. Okay. Alright, what's over here? Hmm. Um, an obstacle course? Oh dear. Alright, peg it! <laughs> Sorry, Ty. Uh, up here, and let's see what we've got. Oh, a thousand! Why are some of these bags just not coloured? I don't get it. Some of them are just plain old silver. Well, they're silvery white. And the other ones have lots of different colours. I don't know, it's really, di really difficult to distinguish between the two. But, yeah, fine. Heaven knows why it was pointing us in this direction, considering that's a dead end, but... I won't question it. I won't question it. Right, off I go in this direction. Let's see what we've got. Hello! I won't go down there just yet. What's up here? Ah! It's another bunyip. One that we can't actually access because I haven't got the key. And yet it still comes up with an exclamation point whenever I go near it. Right, that's the, um... That's like the heavy lifting one. So... Hmm. I'm kind of... Torn here. What am I going to... Ooh. I should have bought the keys. I knew I should have bought the keys. <sighs> right. How big is this? I mean, if not... God, this place is huge. Um... Wow. I have not even scratched the surface of this place, have I, really? Hmm. I'm actually tempted to go back and get the keys. I mean, it's a long way for me, but obviously I'll cut it out for you. I mean, how, how far... Where did I come from? Did I come... I came from the orange star, didn't I? Yeah, so it's not that far in terms of this map. Plus, it means I'll be able to collect all the opals again. Uh, which is... Um, I guess that's a bonus. <sighs> I do apologise for having to do this, but... Oh well. I guess it kind of makes it a bit easier, so I don't have to um, I don't have to get them again. So you can join me again when I've gotten the keys and I'm about to use that uh, lifter bunyip. Can't really remember what it's called. Something like that. <laughs>